Hi guys, it is Renny and today I'm going to be doing a video on looking through my memory box. So, um, yesterday I actually found my memory box. It's just a box filled with stuff that I kept from primary, high school, whatever. Just random things that remind me of a day. And I thought, um, if I did a video on this, this would be like great to look for and there's just so many things that I haven't looked at for a long time, so yeah, give it a thumbs, a uh, big thumbs like, uh, uh, give this a like, subscribe if you haven't already, because I will be posting quite often. I'm sorry if I haven't posted like last week or since my first video, if you haven't watched that, that'll be in the link below, but um, I just didn't know what video to do next, and yeah, so... This is where I keep everything. It's, well, as you see, it's filled with so I dropped something. Oh. So it's filled with a lot of things. So let's get into it because I'm excited to see what I put in in there. I'm just gonna... So the first thing. Oh, this is my um, MP3. It's like a Hannah Montana one. I forgot I even had this, to be honest. I used to listen to music all the time. Uh, I should, like, charge it and see what songs I have. But, yeah, I always had this since, since I used to watch Hannah Montana before the show even ended. I used to have this, as you see. Got like the Mickey Mouse head and stuff, and this. So I'm gonna keep. So yeah, I am. This is cute. Oh, this right. What's this? Kids on you. Oh, so um, cause I'm from Portugal, I go like on holidays and summer holidays and stuff to Portugal. Just last year I um I got this to keep in memory because like I'm gonna turn 16 so when you're like 16 you can't go there anymore but I always went ever since I was little. It's like this playground things where the kid where your parents leave you there so they can go and shop in the mall and it's it's kind of like weird but um it's actually fun. It looks like a play but when you go in there it's like it's like how do I say what it is? It's um, it's like a playground, but it's for like. It's like as if you are older and like it's just to get like an experience of, um, have an experience of being older or something. But yeah, let's. It's got like this. It's called Kids Edge. Yeah, if you haven't been in Portugal before or you're going like this year or something, then go there. Like it finish um. It's any age until until 15, yeah. So if you're younger than 15, then you should t probably go because it's cool. And you get to have a lot of experience. You even get to, like, pretend that you're working as a chef or something. It's great. Really great. It's fun. <sighs> Aw. This is my diary. <laughs> This diary, when was the last time I used it? I think the last time I used this was like in year 8 or something. I don't remember, but yeah, I remember this. I bought this in Portugal, I think. Yeah, I bought this. I remember that I bought this in Claire's. And I don't know how I remember this, but I bought this in Claire's. And it's just fluffy and cute. Look at it. And um, yeah, it's got a lot of things. So I put, I hate scary movies, but I love The Purge, it's amazing. Oh. Wait, The Purge came in 2013, right? Because probably it wasn't that long ago. Yeah, I wrote so much in this diary. I'm not even going to read this. This might be embarrassing. And plus, I don't think 
most of the things that I wrote in this makes sense anyway. But yeah. Oh, right, this was like October something. So this was in my new school where I am now. Uh, in year 10. And um, these boys came to school and they, they came to sing. And so I got like an autograph of all of them. I got quite a few autographs in there, which I know. But yeah, I got that. So this is from primary. This was when I left in year six. And this is a autograph book, whatever thing. And this is just, oh, so cute. Oh, I even put this in everything. Look, look, this, this is cute. Oh, I like this. And um, I wrote, Nani Sulmanj, head teacher, Miss Powell. Oh, I remember her. And then I put teachers, Miss Jarvis, Miss Jones, Miss Charlotte, Miss Powell, and Miss Jones. I wrote Miss Jones twice. Okay, classes C12, C, no, C17, C14, C18, C7, and C2. I don't remember what those classes were, but um, yeah. Then I had to write about, so, because I was like in year six, I wrote like what I liked at the time. So it's here. So I put favourite subject English, which I still like now. Art, I'm not good at it and I don't take it anymore. And EL, I don't remember what EL was, but yeah. Um, when I'm older, I would like to be a singer. First I put teacher, then I, I took it out and put singer. No, teacher, I never want to be. No. Uh, singer, yes, I always wanted to be, but mm, I'm not good at that, so no. Favourite pop star slash band, I put Carly Rae Jackson and Rihanna. I like them, but, but um, um, I don't really listen to them that much anymore. Favourite book, I put none, because I didn't really read book at the time. Now I do, kind of. Favourite TV programme, Shake It Up. I used to watch that at the time and I used to love it so much. Obviously, I like something else now because Shake It Up ended like years ago favorite film titanic and then i put favorite computer game star doll or movie star planet i don't remember those games but yeah favorite food pizza and jelly don't know uh favorite sport tennis that is a lie i never used to even play any sports or even like any sports so that's a lie and then, like, the next page is all autographs from different people, from primary, so, like, so, stuff. Good luck in high school, uh, have a great, uh, have a very good time, we will miss you, don't forget about me ever. Yeah, so many. The lovely grown up Rania. Uh, I will miss you very much. Good luck in high school. And this was for like a teacher or something. But yes, I kept this because I knew that one day, probably year 11 where I am now, I was going to look at this. And yeah, I miss most of the people. I should talk to you. Oh, uh, this was uh, my mum's. 30th birthday party, my mum and her twin sister. Yeah, I wrote, I wrote something at the back, but yeah, that's so important. So yeah, I had this, just to remember the 30th birthday, which I don't remember. I was probably like, what, nine? Oh, oh, this is so cute. This is my music book. I used to write in this all the time. I used to like, I, in year 10, I started taking music as an option and um, I was into like p playing the piano and stuff and I learned how to play the piano. And that year I got chosen by my music teacher to go and sing at this church thing because he said my voice was great and some other girl, but we used to be friends, but I don't know if we're friends anymore. And um, I wrote so much, I even wrote lyrics and stuff. So. For songs that I don't even know. Uh, 
yeah, so, um, getting back together by Taylor Swift, I have the lyrics, because we have to sing in class, I have, like, yes, I don't, uh, how to play piano for a certain song, which it doesn't say here, which song is it? I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, I have, like, so many. Jingle Bells, yes. I learned how to play Jingle Bells when I got so happy. That was the first song. Yeah, the first song that I started playing on the piano. That I learned to play on the piano. I wrote it here, like, the Jingle Bells note and what I needed to do. I wrote so many stuff. I wrote, like, what a hook is. And, um... And then in class we had to make our own music, so I wrote here, there, what my own um, song was going to be. I don't remember this, but I do remember in year, um, I remember in year 10, year 10, year 9, doing this. Oh yeah, um, a lyric song from, I think it was Bob Marley's, one of Bob Marley's songs. No Woman No Cry, I think. I think it's from them, I don't know. Um, and I have to learn the lyrics, and that was like my bit, the one that I highlighted, which was most of it. Um, and yeah, it's great. Yeah, you know, um, I was so into becoming a singer and stuff, which I don't think I'm into that now. But yeah, oh, uh, I knew this was going to be here. This is my first concert, and that was Justin Bieber, My World Tour. This was in, uh, the 20, Sunday the 20th of March 2011. It was at 7.30pm. Oh, it's so cute. The seat where I sat and everything, it, so it was on row uh, K, seat 13, that I sat on. It, oh, it even says everything. It was the best day of my life, I guess. Even today, I love Justin Bieber. First concert I ever been to in 2011. And yeah, so I have this crown. And um, this was just last year when I turned 15. It was in June. So yeah, it wasn't that long ago, to be honest. But yeah, I think I already broke it or something. No. So this was a crown. So I did like a sweet 15. I was one of the sweet 16, but my mum was like, oh, I'll just give her a sweet 15 instead. So I had my sweet 15. But I still want my sweet 16 this year, so. Hope you're watching this, mum. Next thing is this. It's just like birthday, you know, the things that you put there. It says birthday girl, and this was like a Justin Bieber one saying... Bieber fever. <laughs> As you see, I am interested a lot when it comes to Justin. Um, okay, so I have pictures here, which are from school, from my old high school, before I moved. I have uh, two autographs. Wait, let me just... I don't want to rip anything. So, um, one was from a guy called... Tom Sumner. So my cousin knew that. A quick story. My cousin, we were in town and she, she saw this guy that he's famous on YouTube for singing. I didn't really know who he was, and then um, she was like, "Oh my God, it's Tom Sumner." And um, Sumner Summer, I don't know. And then, um, so we went over and she got his autograph, and then I ended up getting his autograph as well. I thought it would be nice, and um. I found that he was dyslexic, like me, and he was like, oh my god, you're my dyslexic friend or something. And, um, yeah, that's all I remember from that day, really. So, yeah, I have this. Um, then I got a, another autograph. This is from an actress in Portugal, so I know. She's called Joana Santos, and um, she's my favourite actress, because I, I watch a lot of soap in Portugal. I don't watch, like, stuff from England or... American, but yeah, uh, this was uh, August the 13th, 2013. I even wrote the date and everything. Best day of my life, by the way. And then I have pictures from my school, my 
of the high school. The one that I left to come to this high school where I am now. So I have pictures with friends. Another friend. A girl that I used to be friends with. Which we're not. Um another really close friend. Another friend. One of my closest friends in that school. Another close friend. Wait, I just dropped something. Me when I was little. Girl that I used to be friends with. This was in Spanish. This was in Spanish. This was in, um... Year 9, I think. Yeah, I'm sure this was in year 9. Another friend. Okay, so this was in, um... Summer Showcase in my old school. It was a great show, to be honest. Other friend. Other friend. Me. So, yeah. That was pretty much it from the pictures, I guess. I need to print out, like, more pictures from my new school with my new friends and... I'm just gonna do that, you know, soon. Um, this was Victoria Lee's prom um, website and shop. I got this because I was like obsessed and started planning my prom. So yeah, I got it with this. Prom, I'm gonna have my prom this year, probably May. So yeah, uh, I'm excited, of course. But, um, yeah, there we have that. Next thing, right, an earring from, this was just like a couple of days ago, actually. This is an earring from my mom's wedding with my stepdad, and, um, it was a really emotional day, and really, it was a great day, you know. Papers. Oh, I get what this is. <laughs> oh, uh, before I left, a friend of mine that was in one of these pictures wrote something about like things that she liked about me, and I always kept this. So when I grew up or when I went off to college, I would read this and remind me of her and remind them. And this is just like what she said, like, what she liked about me, so, yeah, that's cute, thank you. This is not, this is for a cousin of mine, so I'll just leave this. I have a receipt and everything, what is this for? I don't know, oh, Claire's! I brought something in Claire's, I guess. Oh no, this no, it's not. This is Blackbird Ice uh, Arena. This, um, I went skating for the first time with a friend of mine just a couple of days ago. This was actually this year. This was in the 7th of Jan January the 7th, 2017. Um, oh, I got a signature of a Portuguese actor as well. Because, like, when I go to Portugal, I see a lot of famous people there. So, yeah. Um, there. But I don't remember who it was from because I can't really see the name properly. But, yeah. Then I have... Oh, another signature from someone else that I cannot read the name. Yeah. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I 
Then I met these girls, the like girl group. Not like very famous, but um they bought they all gave me autographs and they were so nice guys. Then I got autograph from the same person that came to our school twice, so yeah. Chris Ackington. Yep. Pretty much it. And I have Christmas cards from my friends this year. Lucy. P.S. Justin Bieber suck. I am listening to Mistletoe. Good. From Miss Hopkins. This is my form teacher. She's so lovely. I like her. She's so nice.